What up? We are on our way to cross off number 34 on my list of things to do before I die. My bucket list, if you will. And I got my trusty navigator. She's trying to help me get there. <clears throat> and, uh, yeah. So, anyway, as you watch this video, the main thing I want you to watch or pay attention to is just, or be thinking of, things to do before you want to die. So, if anything was possible and money was no object, what would you do? And make a list. Go out and do the stuff you really want to do because life is short. And you got to live it. You got to live it. Right? Live your life. Hi. Right. We'll see you when we get to there. Hi, my name is Alan, and this is my Buried Life series. If you had one day to live, what would you do? Would you travel the world? Would you tell that special someone that you love them? What if you had your whole life to live? Would you keep adding to that list? So my simple question to you is, what do you want to do before you die? Well, we made it. We made it. It's Rockingham Speedway. There it is. There it is. The rock. Can't really see it that well. You will in a minute. Well, we made it to Rockingham Speedway. We had to get on the mission because she had to get some sunglasses. She's always forgetful. I told her, I was like, we know you weren't a Girl Scout because that's the first thing they teach you, right? Be prepared. <laughs> so she's like, we gotta find sunglasses. I'll pay you back. <laughs> Sorry. We got our tickets, we had to go by Will Call, we got our tickets. And uh, now we're trying to go inside now and check out the trip. Although that was a pretty good trip. So we made it to the track, but we have no idea who we're going to pull for. That's the best part about it. We just wanted to come to the race. Since NASCAR is back in town. You can tell me. We'll figure it out. <laughs>
stylish silks out there in that uh, caution. So we are just uh, working now in the cleanup. Silas took his truck to the garage area. Johnny Sauter, the fourth place runner, the first man in the stop. Yes, he is. He's a Well, congratulations, Casey Kane, from starting at the back of the field and coming to the front and winning the race. That was pretty cool. At least the person that won, I actually know that person. <laughs> I was afraid the person was going to win, but I don't know who that is. <laughs> but anyway. Uh oh, excuse me. <laughs> oh, it's like, it's like dodgeball with people. <laughs> anyway, this race was kind of special for like four reasons. I, I found another one. It, okay, it's our first Rockingham race. It's our first race together that we've been to. It's the first race that the truck series has been here. And, oh, and our first truck race period. So there's a like, it's really cool to be here for the first ever truck event. And it's pretty cool. So congratulations, Casey Kane. Hope you like the footage. And uh, we're gonna head home now. We got about an hour and a half drive. We gotta get something to eat. We gotta keep going. Hmm. Where did I put that white car? It's in the back. In the back. She says it's in the back. I like the front. Uh-uh. I do like the front. But it's in the back. You'll find it. 